The Death's Head Hawk Moth is a mysterious creature surrounded by folklore and legend. Its night flying tendencies and skull shaped markings have led it to be feared as a device of the devil and an omen of death. But the species' behaviour is even stranger than fiction. So let's take a closer look at what makes this moth so unique. The Death's Head Hawk Moth is in fact an expert at stealing honey from honeybee hives. Stealing food from another animal like this is called kleptoparasitism, and it can be a risky strategy. Bees will often attack and kill hive invaders. But the moth has some ingenious adaptations that allow it to sneak inside undetected, stealing a quick meal before making its getaway. The inside of a beehive is a flurry of activity, and bees generally use scent to recognise each other in the dark. The moth has evolved to mimic the scent of a bee, which allows it to chemically camouflage itself inside the hive. Some scientists also think that the skull-shaped marking on its back may in fact resemble a honeybee's head to further calm the suspicious workers. Another possible deceptive tactic is the moth's ability to squeak. It does this by blowing air through its straw-like tongue, called a proboscis. Some researchers argue that this mimics the sound a honeybee queen makes and calms bees that might attack the moth. But it is also used as a defence mechanism against large predators outside the hive. By squeaking while flashing their yellow and black abdomen and hind wings, the death's head hawk moth can confuse and scare away predators. This is an important adaptation because due to their large size, Hawk moths must heat up their flight muscles before flight, meaning they cannot always immediately escape from predators. The Death's Head Hawk Moth is one of the world's most distinctive moths, with striking coloration and large size, but we still have a lot to learn about their biology. Most years, they can be seen in the UK during the summer as they migrate from Africa. Keep an eye out, and if you're lucky enough, you might catch a glimpse of this rare and mysterious visitor. <laughs> 